here's the welcome screen for Flash Professional CS6. There's two kinds of files that we'll be working with through Flash Professional. One of them is the FLA file, the other one's the AS file. The FLA, the Flash file, is created through this ActionScript 3.0 button right here. If I click on that, it'll create a blank FLA for me to start working with. The second kind of file is down here close to the bottom, ActionScript 3.0 class. This creates an ActionScript file. So if I click on this one, it's going to ask me for the name of the class that I'm creating. I'm just going to call it Bob. Not something we'd actually do, but here we go. This is the text file that is going to create an ActionScript class. You can see the keyword here, class, and there's Bob. That's the name of the one that we're going to create. All right, so that is the ActionScript class file. If I create an ActionScript 3.0 file, this is the FLA. Here's the blank stage, the blank workspace that we're working with. This is the kind of file that we're going to work with when creating our visual components, the drawings, the animations, videos, things like that. If we ever lose that welcome screen, because there is a checkbox in the bottom that says do not, don't show this again. If you ever lose that, you want to get this welcome screen back in the preferences menu. If we go to edit preferences, under the general tab right here, there's an on launch. Show the welcome screen, last documents open, welcome screen. That will bring back this little welcome screen. And the welcome screen is really just a shortcut to what you would do from the file menu. File, new. And then it'll say, okay, what kind of thing do you want to create? File new, ActionScript 3.0, or an ActionScript 3.0 class. So either way you do this, through file new or through the welcome screen, those are the two kinds of files that we're going to be working with. Eventually we're going to get to Air for Android, Air for iOS, but we'll be doing those through Flash Builder.